In this video, I'm going to show you how to set the wireless connectivity up on your brother Scan & Cut CM900. This is my machine. I've upgraded from the CM600. I've not cut anything with this machine yet, but I'm going to set up the, the Wi-Fi so that I can transfer files from here to Canvas on my computer or on my iPad wirelessly. Now, my computer's in a different room to my scan and cut, so for this I'm going to use Canvas on my iPad, but you can do it any way that you choose. You do get setting up instructions inside your box, but I thought I'll walk you through the process live as I'm doing it. So I've switched the machine on. I'm going to go into the tools setting and I'm going to look for network which is on page six so I'm going to select the spanner and tool icon next to where it says network so I'm going to select that and it says please wait and then the very first option is WLAN enable and by default it's set to off so I'm going to switch it to on and then I'm going to come to set up wizard and I'm going to click the wrench icon again. And hopefully now that's going to search for my Wi-Fi. What I would say while it's looking, um, you do have to have a Scan & Cut Canvas account set up before you can do this because it's going to ask you for a code in a few minutes. So if you've not already got a Scan & Cut Canvas account, if you, within your, when you get your box with your scan and cut, there's usually a leaflet in there telling you where to find Canvas. I've got a link to it on my blog and my blog address is always at the beginning of my video and there's a link to it on my YouTube channel. Alternatively, if you type scan and cut Canvas login into Google, it should find it for you. So it's found my network now, so I'm going to select that and say OK. Now it's asking me to put my network password in. So I've got that written down on a piece of paper. So I'm just going to turn the machine so that I can see it. And I'm going to put the password in. Now it's all case sensitive, so you have to use uppercase and lowercase if that's how your password for your Wi-Fi is. when I've put the settings in. And then it says apply settings, so I'm gonna say yes. And hopefully that will connect to the Wi-Fi within my house. Okay, so it's telling me now it's connected. Specify the can scan and cut online setting in order to send cutting data between the scan and cut canvas and the machine. So I'm just gonna follow it through. So I'm gonna say next. So it's, uh, it's telling me now there's two pages in this section and it's telling me now to prepare a computer or a tablet. Well, in this case, I'm using a tablet. So I'm going to say next. And then it's saying to me, log into Scan and Cut Canvas and get a pin code. That's what I want to do. So it says step one, click this icon, which is the icon that looks like the person. So I'm in my Scan and Cut Canvas account and I've gone to the, don't know if you can see it here, I've gone to the little blue person, which is in the top right hand corner, and it brings up all my account details. And then if you scroll down somewhere, it should say get pin code. So I'm going to click the get pin code. And then hopefully it's going to generate or it's going to ask me for a number first. OK, so I don't know if you, how well you're going to be able to see this. I'll try and zoom in. But on the bottom here, it's asking me for a number. And in the, in the diagram here, it's showing me where it is on the scan and cut. So that number there, I now have to type into this box. And then on the iPad, once I've typed that in, I'm going to say next. And hopefully I've put the right number in. So this is working now. And it's obviously thinking about doing something. And now it's given me a pin code here. So now I've typed that number in, OK, and I'm going to type the PIN number now that's on my iPad into here. And 
and then I'm going to say OK. Now it says the scan and cut online setting has been specified, so I'm going to say OK. And then it says scan and cut online, scan and cut, scan and cut canvas login, which is me. And I'm going to say OK, and I think that's it. So what I'm going to try and do now, quickly, I'm just going to go into create new pattern on my iPad and I'm just going to choose a shape, a basic square, to choose download and see if it gives me the option for Wi-Fi transfer which it does here, scan and cut transfer. So I'm going to select that. And it says the scan and cut transfer is ready. Scan and cut canvas is ready to transfer the cutting data to your scan and cut machine. I'm going to say close and see if that's transferred that to the machine. So I'm going to go to pattern. I'm going to go to the cloud because that's how we're transferring it, Wi-Fi through the cloud and see if it retrieves that square and there it is. So there's the square I've just put on a canvas mat. So I hope you found that helpful. Please give the video a thumbs up if you did. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel and then you'll um, be able to get notified when I upload any other videos. Make sure the bell icon is switched on on your YouTube. That's the notifications. If that's not switched on, even if you subscribe, you won't get notifications when I upload. Thanks very much and hopefully I'll see you again in my next video.